Now, uh, question is here. We can we are continuing from where we last stopped. Now. So we are joining these two points. These are in a rectangle. And now, this point to this point, it is visible. So we join the points with a visible line. And as well, from here to here, we join it. Let me make it more broader. Now. This is well drawn. This is well shown. Or oh, this is well shown. And maybe let me draw a line <coughs> that is thin that passes through these two points. So there it is. Even these two points. Because we will need it when we are projecting the end, the, the end view when it comes to drawing it. Yeah. We have this, we have this, we have this, we have this. Yeah. So since it is our our section, remember this is cut at PP, and this is what is being cut. So, now, because it is a section, and you know, for sections, we use 45. Let me use a bigger, bigger 45 set square. Yeah, so now we are going to draw our sections. We use 45 set square. So now we may decide to say that we are going to use from each line, this is our first line, we will be like, let's use a distance of 0 0.4. So, now we are drawing our sections using 
you fill the dimensions that you used, or you can draw evenly from each other, like how I'm doing. I'm not using the dimensions that I used. So this is our front view, front section of front view. And we are done. So now, that is part A. Part B, the plane with the hidden details. Now, these lines that we drew are helping us. Now, our plan, when you look up, you still have this same dimension down. You only need to measure as long as you have drawn accurately these lines. You only need to draw to measure from here to here, that would be like the width of the, the figure two, which is now drawing is 88 millimeters. So you measure. From this point, after our middle line, the dimension line. There. And also from this point. There. And then you join the, the points. This is our plan, we are looking from up of figure two. And join the points. Join this. And go down this. There we are. So. With our plan, we can start from this side or this side. So let's begin from this side. Now. We have said the plan with all hidden details. There is a square 
on top. And this square, it has a dimension of 72 on top, and the width of it is 64. So 64 and 72. And now, from this point, the corner, from this point, this point to a certain point, that is 10. So you get, on this point, you mark 10. And that is, from this point, around here, Our ten is somewhere there. So from this point up to a certain point on this one, because you can see the projection here. It is 72. So you measure as well. 10 millimeters, that is 1 centimeter. You mark. And then you join the two points. And as well, now, up, it is the same dimension. This side, there is a small rectangle inside the big rectangle. But let's just draw the outer rectangle. Now, this is one centimeter. And up, you want to get this dimension. It should be one centimeter as well. On this line, this. And this is our rectangle. And join the two parts together. That is the outer rectangle. But there's an inner rectangle it has 48 and inside it is outside is 72 inside it is 48 so seventy two minus forty eight That is two, 24 and 24 apart, that is 12. Oh. So we measure 1.2, somewhere there, 1.2. Somewhere there, 1.2, somewhere there.
Now we have got the dimensions of the rectangle. So we draw a perpendicular aligned against the two points together. So now we want to draw our inner rectangle. So now, from this point to this point is 6.4, and inside it is 48. So 48 minus 64. That is 16. So we take Eight, that is eight millimeters. Sorry, eight centimeters. Zero point eight centimeters on this line. That is our inner, inner square inside the rectangle. Now, there is, there is this, and we are drawing it here. Now, it is in the middle, in the middle of 64. And we have this as 88, and this is 6.4. And in the middle of 64, that is around 32. Three point two is here. That is our thirty two as well. Three point two is somewhere here. So we draw a faint line, then the two points. So this is the middle middle side of the 
the tube that joins, which is this, from here to here. And this is shown to be 12 millimeters, that is 1.2. That means when we divide 12 by 2, that gives us 6. So that is six, 0 0.6 centimeters, that is 6 millimeters. This is our 6 from, the, from, the, from this point to this point. And then from here to this point, that is 6. And as well, to draw the line, because I have to project this to draw the end view. From this point to here is our 6. And from this point to this point is 6. So we draw a line joining the two points together. And this is now out here. So we, we broaden because it is seen in the plan. What else is being shown in the plan? I believe that is all. It is all hidden details. Now, this is our plan. So we are going to use it to draw, to project the end view. We are done with our plan. Now I'm going to have to draw all these lines so that I can use it to project on this side, the end view, from point S. So I have all my points here. So now we are drawing the end view, We're showing the end elevation projected from views 4A1 and 2, which is this and this, as seen in the direction of ROS. So our end view is going to be here. From this point, it's projected. Sorry about this.
this. Now, from here to here has been projected on this side. So we draw our, our lines, parallel lines. At all points, this one is done, already drawn. So we go to another one. These are our lines, our word drawn. So now we are going to use them to project the end view. They are from, these lines are from the front elevation and the plan. So when you are standing here at S, this, the down, the down the side is 88, so you measure 88 from this point, which is already here, you can see, is 8 from our last top to here, it is 88. So you broaden the line up, it is 20, which is this, which is already here. And then there is 10, 10, which is, which is from here to here, that is one centimeter, you can see, from here to here, it's already from this point, it's being projected here, which is already here, this point, and as well from this point, This is from here to here. This is our point. 
then up is 36 from this point which is this point same thing from here now we have from this point what we are able to see is this which is this being projected here up to this point and then there's a line now this is our our end view from side from point s it is well projected here now this is this carries 18 marks this is 18 this is 19 